Today we're going to show you in this video how to access the Vico iMac hosting allowing you to gain access to all your business Internet Explorer functions Vico iSchool functions if you're a member there as well as our QBoss users and affiliates. Now this is on a Mac iPad device and we go to the App Store, which everyone should know, assuming you know the App Store, search Remote Desktop, or RDP, and as you can see, that's the logo right there, RDP Lite. It's free. Download it, and once you download it, you just click it. Now it's going to ask you to configure right here. You're going to already configure this hosting account, which we have, and there's the configuration number. And that number we will give you along with your username and password. And the number there is 50.18.124.210. Once it's configured, obviously save your settings and simply connect just by touching it. And just that quick, you are now in your world of Internet Explorer or Windows. Internet Explorer is down at the bottom. When you configure that, it'll ask you to put in your username and password into the RPD, RDP application and it'll save it for you so you just have to log right in and you don't have to keep entering your information. I want to explain a few of the icons here. As you can see in the lower right, this reduces the, the keyboard. See the keyboard right here in the left? You click that, brings your keyboard up, reduce your keyboard, click this down arrow to open up the screen more. You'll see an Internet Explorer option here, the same functions as iMac has where you can expand and contract with your fingers. Simply touch that and that'll give you the Internet Explorer. Now you'll have to configure your favorite pages. In this case we have the portal for Vico iSchool which is one of our services and if you'd like to know more about that visit our web form that we have set up and it's a great service for schools. For the QBoss users, there's standard QBoss login screen URL. You want to save that. I save it right in my favorites bar and once you do that you simply type in your login information which you have. Once you do it, obviously it's Internet Explorer. It'll save it. Simply hit login. Sometimes you have to just double tap it and there you have it. Now if you want to make this screen larger we suggest hitting F11 like you would do on your keyboard except the keyboard really doesn't understand that same function so you want to go over to view and where it says full screen simply hit full screen. Now you have the full screen look you are now completely in QBoss environment on your iMac or iPad. Well, that's really it, folks. You're there. Everyone else would understand how to, who's part of a QBoss environment, understands the rest of QBoss. One thing I do want to point out is when you want to get back, we like everyone to completely log out when they're finished of the hosting. Obviously, you want to log out of your program here that you're in. So you can just double tap upper right, logging out of QBoss. Yep. Now I'm logged out. You want to go back to your screen you can't you see you don't see any of the tools at the top so on the iPad you just kinda have to touch up here to the upper left and then it appears and then over on the right under tools click that and you'll see full screen again and just simply hit full screen tap that and you come back to your normal screen and there you are now if you want to close out completely I'm trying to hold this steady for my viewers you can leave it like that or you can hit your X and close out but we do suggest when you're leaving the hosting just simply go to the start menu and over here on the little arrow right there you want to hit click that and log off just simply log off that way it clears the data and that's it folks thank you for using Vico hosting and at that point you can just close out and you're back to your 
iPad. And it's as simple as touching your RDP application, hitting connect, and it takes you right back in. And it's that simple. And then you have access to your icons at the bottom to launch Internet Explorer. Have a great day. Hope you enjoy the service. And again, don't forget, you gotta log off.